Hi guys! It's Lydia and I'm here today to introduce a new series to my channel. But first of all, who am I? Hi, I'm Lydia. I'm 22 and I live in London. This series is about anxiety and I'm going to hand you over to Lou. Hey guys, it's Lou, I am 23 and I am from Scotland. If you don't know me, then hi, hello. I am a small YouTuber who makes various mental health related videos. I raise awareness and hopefully end stigma that surrounds mental health. I do not claim to be a professional or anything of the sort. I just like to give advice based on my own experiences. Thank you to Lydia for this amazing video idea and thank you for letting me be a part of your series. I am very excited to be working with you here on this series today. I cannot wait to get it started. What's going on you guys? I constantly talk about wanting to start a conversation about mental health and I've been thinking all these years that I've done YouTube, how can I make that happen? How can I make this thing that we all say a reality? And then it hit me, then it hit me that my camera died because I'm an idiot who forgot to put it on charge. Okay, phone vlog. So I've been thinking for all these years that I've done YouTube, how on earth can I start a series that has a meaningful conversation with people? Because a lot of creators like myself, like Louise, who is a big part of the series, we struggle with phone calls. So we couldn't Skype each other to do it. We couldn't video call to do it. We couldn't live stream to do it. And that's what it hit me. Let's write a script and do it like a conversation, but through a script. We're basically answering each other and bouncing off each other still, but without physically being there and without the anxiety follows. So welcome to a new series. This is the mental health show. I know this series is all about anxiety and our co-host of the season is Louise. <laughs> So I am here on Lydia's channel today with this brand new series with you guys because I am coming on here to talk about myself. That sounds so big headed, like I'm here to talk about me. Not like that, trust me, not like that. I am here to talk to you guys today about my story with mental health, my mental health conditions, what exactly am I diagnosed with, how does my mental health affect me. I'll be sharing some story times, I will be sharing my own experience with mental health and various other topics and I cannot wait to get started because in a weird way, mental health is something that I absolutely love to talk about. Like, I just love getting into deep conversations. I love to raise awareness and do different things like short films, documentaries. So yeah, I'm very honoured to be here and I really appreciate Lydia giving me a platform to come over and talk about my own experiences with mental health. So if you haven't already guessed by the title and the thumbnail and what Lydia said in the beginning of this video, this entire series is based just on anxiety and our own personal experiences with anxiety and we want to end the stigma, raise awareness and be there for you guys and hopefully educate you all at the same time. <laughs> well. I've been Lou and this has been my introduction. So this first episode is like getting to know us, who we are, our story is, blah blah blah. So in this I'm going to be sharing my first experience of anxiety. I feel like I've struggled with anxiety my entire life. It's literally been on my diagnosis paperwork since the beginning of I always remember growing up as a kid, being that kid in the class that couldn't, like, I couldn't talk, I couldn't answer my name on a register, dude, I was speaking out loud, whenever we had to sing in assembly, and there was like six years worth of kids in this one room, no one's obviously gonna hear me, I couldn't do it, so I would literally mouth the words, because if the school thought you was faking it, they'd make you do it on your own, which is fucking wrong thinking about it. Like they they'd make you do it. They'd, be, they'd make you stand up in front of everyone and sing these fucking hymns, rhymes. I don't know. I didn't get to a religious school, so I think they were just like primary school. But I used to mouth the words because I knew the words. But I used to just mouth it, so uh, it was no sound coming out, so no one could hear me at all. I never got caught out for that. So teachers from my primary schools, if you're watching them. I cheated the assembly, but I, I literally couldn't ask for help. So I have been on YouTube for six years and I have two channels. So when I started to make videos first, second year, 
I used to make advice and uh, mental health videos on my main channel and then I moved over in 2016 and made my own channel, which I have now, for mental health and advice because I just wanted to separate the topics and it was just easier for me so I've been doing that now for three going on four years. Oh my god I've had that channel. Okay anyway. <laughs> over on my second channel I will always do my best to post every single Thursday and it's usually at 12 p.m UK time. Back in the days I used to do it at 8pm and then I found I get better views and stuff by posting early afternoon and that just kind of gives me like my day to myself so that's what my schedule is now. Sometimes I'll post a story time video, sometimes I'll post a short film, a documentary, poem video, I'll do something with maybe some quotes. I make a lot of different collab videos. I'm trying to do more on my mental health channel because I do a lot on my main channel. I'm trying to start up a couple different series for next year so it's just trying to get everything kind of organised for that but the point is I make a lot of different types of mental health videos and give advice. I'm really really passionate about mental health so talking about mental health is really important to me and it's one of my favourite topics to talk about and my favourite time, my favourite all time topic to talk about is anxiety because I suffer with a lot of anxiety. I kind of always have and I probably always kind of will to a certain extent but you know like we'll dive in deep to all of that stuff like because the episode's gone. This is just like your kind of introduction type of episode but I have quite a lot of knowledge on anxiety which is kind of why I agreed to come on here and like share my own experiences in the hopes that it will help you guys. I struggle with various mental health conditions, it's not just anxiety but anxiety is like my main one. Anxiety is the mental health condition that I suffer with the most and the most severe so... <laughs> Mental health has definitely been my all-time struggle since I was a young teenager, around 13 to 14. But yeah, as I said before, I, I'm really excited to see where this series goes and how you guys take to it. We hope you guys enjoy it. So this is it for the first episode, so I really hope you guys enjoyed this. And if you did, then let us know down in the comments if you think the series is a good idea, what topic you'd like us to talk about, and you know, so we can plan some more episodes for you guys. Big big thank you to Lydia once again for having me on your channel, for having me on this series. I'm so excited to get started and I hope you guys have a wonderful day slash night and I'll see you guys very soon. Mwah. Peace out! Lou out! <laughs>